Bismillah, we've had a case where this girl was getting healed. She, a lot of the sihar was leaving her. To the point, a lot of sihar was found within the home where they destroyed. Wallahi, parents, mothers and fathers, at times, they don't understand the correct way of healing. They think like a piece of paper and just giving it to them to burn in their house. A piece of paper with grids on them is going to protect them by going to the magicians and they're giving you something physical to protect you. The Iman is in the heart. The Iman is in the heart, my brothers and sisters. So this is a message to our aunties and our uncles. Do not go to these peds and these maulanas and these uh, these mess ups and, and th these stuff where where they take your name, they take your date of birth, they take the mother and father's name, their date of birth, they take the pictures. Do not go to them. They won't heal you. They're going to bring more trouble in your home. I've had a case, and a lot of the sihar was leaving them. I've had a case where this client was getting healed. And this ain't just this client, many other clients where they were getting healed. And subhanAllah, when, when I realized that every time the the girl is coming uh, to the center one of the parents is missing so when 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 questioning okay where is so and so parent the parent doesn't believe in this stuff then later on we find out wait a minute that parent was the one that's call, calling the the Maulanas and the peers back home and getting tarries at home and putting it in certain places at home where the person and the, uh, uh, where the jinn or the sihr was affecting their own child fear Allah fear Allah in this matter fear Allah in this umur where you get these things to heal you and protect you but you're just inviting shayateen and magic and spells at home that's causing more problems to your daughter or to your son or to your wife or, to, or for your husband fear Allah Stick to the Quran and Sunnah. Stick to the Tilawat al Quran only. I've had cases where clients were getting healed. The jinns were leaving them. And the parents, they feared that it will come back. So they thought they'll go and get a Tawiz again to stop that affliction from coming back. But guess what? That Tawiz that they bought home, it affected them even more. So stay away from any type of sihr or any type of ritual that there's a question mark to it. This ain't going to heal you. What's going to heal you is the words of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, dua and ibadah, and make sure you do your morning and evening. Assalamu alaikum.